cold. Okay. Yikes, it's cold. Yikes! And this is huge. We moved um, Maleficent's babies out. Everybody else is pregnant and looking pretty happy. Here's Daddy Bunny. And then we have a new cage that I just built. It's for letting everybody grow out. But I need to go get... Everybody out there has their shelter, but I'm kind of thinking I want to move the two out in the field into the shed. This is why I have multiple shelters. So the girls really, really didn't want to be out in the rain. They really don't like it out there. Yeah. So, I'm messy getting ready to go into the fiber fair. I'm gonna go grab their water so they have it. And they, the problem is they were getting hungry out there. They didn't want to get out of their shelters to go eat and get wet. So in here, they'll eat their food and I don't have to worry that they're hungry. Hi, mama. Remember, this is, this is chamomile. And this is chai. Huh. Chai is a first time freshener. She has fantastic teats. She's giving about a quart and a half, maybe two quarts per day. I only milk once a day. It's plenty for our family. We have Empress in the backyard still. And they should be just fine. The reason they're out here together is they get along better. Um, uh, chamomile hates Empress. Uh, but soon the others will be moved out. I'm just sitting here jabbering. Maybe it's because I don't want to go out in the rain. But I need to go get their water and I need to go water the greenhouse. See, I've got it hooked to that eye bolt. So they can't knock it over. So there's their water. It's raining now. I'm trying to see if I can find a spot where this can sit and see everything. So one thing I wanted to talk about is that I have found a lot of different funguses want to grow when you have a deep bed, uh, deep mulch system. So far they haven't seemed to be um, detrimental to anything, but uh, you do have some interesting funky things growing on your, on your straw. 